probably tell from the title of this video, this is going to be a haul, but it's not going to be like your typical clothing haul because I actually have no idea what I am about to unbox. Um, I had my friend Delaney Childs, who is an influencer. She's got the coolest style. If you don't already follow her, I mean, I'm sure you do, but check her out. I'll link her right here. I recruited her to go on a shopping spree for me and pick out some pieces that I wanted to reveal, or I guess like reveal to myself. What? I don't know. This isn't making sense, but I'm gonna basically open it on camera. I don't know what I got. I don't know what she ordered. She just shipped it to me and so we're going to experience this together so yeah i'm gonna open it all up see what she got me give you guys my reactions and then we will try and style it okay so it's from azos clearly again i have no idea you guys i have no idea how many pieces i have no idea if it's like clothing accessories i can tell there's probably no shoes because of the way that it's bagged but let's let's see i'm scared probably for the grab scissors. Okay, let's take a look. Oh, okay. So far, I think I'm gonna like this one. Okay, this is cute. It is a Sherpa shirt, or a faux Sherpa shirt, um, or shearling, or whatever the hell you wanna call it. It's actually brand misguided. So this is one of the things I love about ASOS is they actually carry a bunch of brands that I love to shop in one place so you don't have to pay for like shipping multiple times. So if you like Misguided but you also want to shop other brands, it's ASOS, I tell ya. I'm stoked to style this. That'll be really cute. And it's nice and oversized. It's light. It's like that faux Sherpa look. So off to a good start, Delaney. Thank you. What else we got? Uh-oh. I see something that scares me. I don't know if I'm emotionally ready, so we're gonna leave that. I think these are pants. Okay, these are cute. I feel like I have to see these on. They seem, nope, just kidding, they're not stretchy. And they've got some faux leather trim on them, and then it's like a straight leg with, if you can see that, like a split seam. Hopefully these fit because I got a big butt and wide hips. All right. Always love me some denim. Although I will say denim is like, it either fits you or it doesn't. Okay, so this is ASOS brand. They look, I'm trying to think of like how, actually they look quite high-waisted. They look a little, like they might be a little short for me though, but they are cuffed up so I could always, you know, uncuff. <laughs> that would be smart for me. I like the color though. It's like, um, like a gray navy, if that makes any sense. We will see. I will style these with something, we will see. Okay, we got three more things. I'm not sure if I should like leave the one that is kind of scaring me till the end or if I should just bite the bullet. Okay, we'll do one, we'll do one more and then I'll do the scary one and then I'll finish with something that hopefully is good. I hope I've just decided in my head this one is bad. Okay. My shirt gave me a wedgie. So far it's a small black package. I'm confused, is this the top or is this pants or is this a bodysuit or what the hell is this? I'm confused. Oh, it's a one shoulder top. But you could see why I was confused, right? Maybe it would be cute with the black pants. I don't know, we're gonna have to see what vibes here. Guys, we're gonna go. We're gonna go for the scary item. Can we just take like a moment? Send good vibes my way. The fact that this girl thinks I can pull this off is fucking funny. Delaney! This, you guys, is a beaded, like, corset top. Don't get me wrong, it's cute. But like, I don't know where I'm going that I'm gonna wear this. Like I would wear this probably to like a concert, but that's not happening these days. I'm just gonna, we'll see how I style this. This is gonna be the fun part is like, we're just seeing it and then I'm gonna actually put it on, which could be tragic or great. Okay, last item. This one looks cute. I like this. This is very my vibe. 
like a little, it's got elastic in the bottom here. It's like a polo, long sleeve crop. Really into this. Okay. Okay, I can work with this. So far I have hope for four of the five items. It's not bad. It's like 80%. No, it's more than 80%. I'm bad at math. So now I'm gonna put some of the stuff on and we will, we'll see. We'll see, we'll get a final verdict of how things are going and if I'm gonna keep it or if I'm gonna return it. Okay, I just went for it and I've got the, the out of the comfort zone top on. To be honest, I don't hate it. I'm still wearing my bra, so you can't see the bra straps, sorry guys. It is a bit big on me though. Um, I think I would need to size down because there's like a lot of room back there. And without a bra, my boobs wouldn't fill it out. So I love that for me, but this is really fun. I would probably wear it with some lighter denim. Um, and then maybe like a denim jacket, like a fun, Canadian tuxedo or something, you know, it's not as bad as I thought, but I definitely do need a different size These jeans I do like um, I have wide hips here. So sometimes Jeans that are like more meant to be baggier don't always Really look cute on me. I would probably only wear them with like a more fitted top just because they are baggier I think I will keep the jeans though. Sorry. There's so many different camera angles because I'm trying to show you the full outfit Okay, let's see what else this stuff looks like. Okay, so next up is obviously this Reclaimed Vintage. Um, I love it. We're hitting golden hour here, sorry. So you're gonna get some shadows, but um, I think it's super cute. I love the coloring on it. I love the contrast, the little polo zip. I think it's so cute. This is definitely, definitely a keep. I'm gonna commit to this. I'm gonna go take this off. That's how much I love this one. I'm willing to commit to cutting tags off. This is the first item that I showed you guys, the like faux Sherpa. It's like a shacket, I guess, but it's really lightweight and like very cozy. So I would probably style this with like my Doc Martens and some socks or like higher up lug boots. If I had an oversized leather jacket that would fit over this, all of mine will probably be a little bit too fitted. I would do that with like lug sole boots. I think that'd be so cute. Maybe I'll have to buy a leather jacket that's oversized next to go with this. Love, love, love. Thank you. Delaney nailed it on this one. Well, you see, we got a bit of an issue here. <laughs> These aren't gonna do up. If I'm being honest also, I don't think I would keep them. I think they're just a touch short on me anyways. They just, I don't think would look right. I have been on the look for a pair of pants with the front slit that are high-waisted and long enough for me for months. So I get the look she was going for and the piece that she picked out. Like I love the idea. They just don't fit my body right. So Delaney, either pass. This is not your fault. This is no one's fault. We're just not compatible, you know? We're gonna try the last top, which I'm actually excited about. I just don't know if it will look good on me, but we will we'll experience this together. And I'm so sorry for this sun, you guys. I'm probably gonna like wanna reshoot this whole video now, but I'm probably gonna be lazy. This is just a lot of skin. I think the top is so cute. I don't know that it's cute on me. To be honest, I've always been very self-conscious of my arms, so that's just like an insecurity. But I do like love the concept the design of the top i definitely need some double-sided tape here i just don't know if i'm going to keep the top yet so i'm not committed to that i also don't want to take off my self tan that i have on i do like it it's just definitely out of my comfort zone being this much of a crop and like exposed like this side's cool. Like, hey, love this top. This is cute. I'm going out, you know, like just in a cute little top. Who is she? Is she going to the beach? Is she naked? Who knows? <laughs> I'm such a dork. Maybe leave a comment if you guys think that I should keep this one, step outside my comfort zone. Um, or if this top just isn't made for me, you know? Me and my little tiny boobs. Vote now. 
Friends, if you like this style haul, please let me know. Leave a comment, subscribe, you know the drill. Um, <laughs> gotta say it. But huge thank you to Delaney for helping me out and challenging me to step outside my comfort zone with fashion. I think that it's important. We don't have to think we can't pull stuff off and look at me. Maybe I will keep that beaded. I mean, maybe I'll get a different size than that beaded top and rock it around. I was going to say the Christmas tree because it's December, but probably not. So thank you for watching. Leave a comment below. Let me know your favorite piece. Um, I will link everything as well below. So if you like something, you can grab it for yourself and we can be twins. And then let me know who you think I should have go shopping for me next because this was fun and I want to do it again. So thanks friends. Subscribe. Love ya.